Madam Registrar, would you call the case, please? Yes, Your Honor. Good afternoon, Your Honor. This is the case number IT037TI, the prosecutor of the tribunal against Stratton Lukic. Thank you. Well, we are here this afternoon to conduct the initial appearance before the tribunal of Mr. Sretan Lukic. And I address myself, first of all, to Mr. Lukic. Mr. Lukic, can you hear the proceedings so far in your own language? I can, Your Honor. Please be seated. Thank you. May I now take the appearances, first of all, for the prosecution? Thank you, Your Honor. Thomas Hannes for the Office of the Prosecutor. I'm assisted by Christina Moeller on my left, Carolyn Edgerton on my right, and our case manager, Susan Grogan. Thank you, Mr. Hannes. And for the accused? Good afternoon, Your Honor. My name is Victor Copper. I'm assigned by the registrar. Thank you, Mr. Copper. Now, Mr. Lukic, could you stand again, please? Um, I would like to uh, clarify formally uh, your identity. Can you state for the record, first of all, your full name? I am Sreten Lukic. Your date of birth? I was born on the 28th of March, 1955. And the address at which you were residing prior to departure to come here? Belgrade, the street of Banjičkih Žrtava, number 36, Serbia. Have you received an indictment in which you are charged with three other accused uh, by the names of Pavkovic, Lazarevic and Dordovic in a language that you clearly understand? Yes, Your Honour. And are you aware that the indictment contains five separate counts or charges against you? Yes, sir. Yes. Thank you. Again, please be seated. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Copper, have you had an opportunity to discuss the terms of the indictment with Mr. Lukic. Um, Your Honour, I spoke to Mr. Lukic this morning, uh, but it was a very brief visit, so I have not been able to go into great detail um, in respect of the contents of the indictment. But so, I, uh, yes? But I have spoken briefly uh, with him about the indictment. Uh, and uh, is he in a position to tender pleas to the various counts on the indictment today? Uh, no, Your Honour, not today. Um, we would like to enter the plea um, as uh, prescribed in Rule uh, 62 within 30 days from, from today. Uh, do you envisage that you will be acting for him uh, at that stage? I assume that is a possibility, but I cannot say at this stage. So far I'm only appearing for him today, but there might be a possibility that I will be appearing for him as well um, in, uh, 30, within 30 days. But as that's of course up to Mr. Lukic to decide. Um, can, can I take it then from, from what you've said so far that there is no point at this stage in going into the detail of the indictment that that can be dealt with insofar as it is necessary uh, when you are in a position or someone else is in a position in, on his behalf to tender an appropriate plea to each of the charges. Right, Your Honour, that's it. Thank you very much.
Now, Mr. Hannes, um, do you see any particular difficulty about uh, continuing the case for the full period of 30 days? No, I don't, Your Honor. We have filed a motion to join the co-defendant, General Lazarevich, with Militinovich, Oidanyets, and Shayinovich. We intended that motion to include this defendant and others that may appear later on. Um, but I don't, I don't think that's a cause to del that would uh, bar us giving him the 30 days he's allowed under the rule. Yeah. So, so if I uh, appoint uh, an adjourned diet of today's procedure for 29 or 30 days hence or thereabouts, um, you would have no objection to state to that? No, Your Honor. Do you have anything else to comment on at this point? Only, Your Honor, I was aware that uh, through media reports that this defendant had some health problems. I know it's not a requirement, but I thought it might be appropriate to address those with him at this time and be sure he's getting all the appropriate treatment he needs. Now, you can take it, Mr. Copper, that um, I will be happy to uh, continue this hearing for the period that, that you suggest. Um, is there any other matter that, that you wish to address me on? Uh, not at this stage, Your Honor. Mr. Lukic, could you stand again, please? In a moment, I, I will fix a date when you will appear again uh, at the tribunal, probably before me, at which stage it will be necessary for you to tender pleas of guilty or not guilty to the various counts against you. That's the only formal matter now that requires to be dealt with this afternoon. However, this is your opportunity to raise with me any matter that you consider it appropriate to raise at this stage on which you think I am in a position to take action. Is there any such matter? Your Honor, there are no particular issues that I would like to raise procedure that concerns my health is under the supervision uh, of a doctor, sir. There is nothing that I have to object to. I have no proposals to make because on Monday a cardiologist will come uh, and uh, as of Monday, he will be monitoring my, monitoring my health uh, condition. Thank you very much. Mr. Lukic, please again be seated. Thank you, Your Honor. Now, um, Tonya, or Chu Cheng, a date for the continued appearance? Sorry?
Well, what I shall do to uh, bring these proceedings today to a close is to adjourn the initial appearance uh, of Mr. Lukic until Wednesday, the 4th of May. There will be a scheduling order issued specifying the time at which that continued appearance will take place. And as I indicated then, uh, Mr. Lukic, you will require to tender your pleas to the court. The court is now adjourned. All right. Feu vous levez.